Oh, gosh, what a day. Is that you, Katie? Yes, Mom! I mean, who else can it be? Looks like Mom's friends came over again last night. She's been seeing them a lot since what happened to Dad. Maybe to- Come on, I've been cooped up in my room for hours! Jeez, pulling my hair out trying to figure out the math problem Miss Wormwood gave us. I deserve a break, right? Grandpa and Grandma from New York gave it to me for my last birthday. I really ought to read it, or at least dog-ear the pages so it looks like I did. The piano that Mom ordered will soon be here. I couldn't bring myself to tell her that I wanted a drum kit instead. Mm, 
mom bought those again. Mm, mom bought those again. Wow. I hope I get to travel around the world too when I grow up. Oh, hello, Munchkin. Hey, Mom. Is everything okay, Katie? We haven't seen Grandpa and Grandma for a long time. Mom says they'll probably come over from New York on her birthday. Hmm. You forgot your music box. Be careful with that, please, Munchkin. Where'd this come from? I already told you. Your grandma and grandpa gave it to me when I was little. Doesn't look like it's from New York, though. I don't know. Must have been in the family forever. I just love it. You've always liked it. Ever since you were little. Will you give it to me when I'm big? Maybe, if you're a good girl, when I get old. So when will that be then? Later, Katie. But when? In a very, very long time, I guess. When I'll be gone. Dear Kate, wherever you are now, despite the sad news it contains, I hope this letter reaches you in time. Oh, give it a rest, Olivia. Ah, oh, what the hell? You want me to call you Olivia? Fine. I've survived worse criticism. I shouldn't put it off. I better call Olivia while I have the courage. I shouldn't put it off. I better call Olivia while I have the courage. <sighs> Who do you think you are, Olivia Foster? 
It's easy to judge and lecture me from New York. You know nothing about what I've gone through, of what I've had to endure since leaving Hans. I should be so nervous about making a simple phone call. I mean, hey, I've crossed Europe, been in all sorts of danger, and yet look at me here. I'm worrying about talking to my former best friend. <laughs> oh, and I think I used to spend my life on the phone gossiping with her. So what do I risk? Criticism? The one who missed her mother's funeral because she was breaking rocks at the bottom of a mine. In any case, Olivia hasn't stopped criticizing me ever since I left Valadelen on Hans Vorlberg's train. I'm the one who should be criticizing her. I mean, come on. Isn't she the one who took advantage of my absence to get her hooks into Dan? <laughs> now look at me, mulling over old grudges. That's exactly what I wanted to escape from when I decided to go with Hans in his train to Siberia. And then there was the departure with the Yukul tribe, their seasonal migration. Come on, Kate, for Christ's sake, stop procrastinating. Just make the darn call and get it over with. Mr. Canton, is that you? Who's there, please? Olivia, it's me, Kate. Kate? Gee, it's so weird to hear your voice after all these years. Got your letter, Olivia. Uh, Kate, I sent it two years ago. I know. Things have been... complicated. Complicated? I see. And so when are you coming back to New York? You know, to visit your mother's grave? You know I can't come back, Olivia. I'm still wanted by the police over the sale of the Vorlberg factory. Oh, I haven't forgotten. Believe me. If only you knew how much the accusations hurt your mother. Visits from the police, the requisitions, and just when she was diagnosed, too. And yet, the poor woman never stopped hoping that her daughter would come back one day. Or at least call, to help her in her final days. I don't have to justify myself to you, Olivia, or to anyone else. <sighs> Kate, I... Ugh! Okay, listen to me. I thought you had plenty of time to think about how you abandoned all of us. Me, your mother... Dan, or even that poor Mr. Canton, and maybe felt at least some remorse. But I guess I was dreaming. All you do is keep chasing castles in the sky and ignore those who care about you. I get why you're mad. Do you think I'm not mad at myself? Well, I hope so. But there's nothing I can do now to change what happened. It's over, Olivia. All I have now 
is the woman in the painting. Oh, Kate. I should have known. And I should never have asked you to call me. Goodbye, Kate. I hope you find whatever it is you've been looking for these past three years. One thing's for sure, though. You wanted to be alone, and that's how you're going to stay. Okay, let's go, kiddo. Another day, another page. A new day in Wagen. I must take the tram to that music academy where Dana Rose was a student in the 1930s. With a bit of luck, they'll have kept her records. Demoiselle Lenny told me the music academy is near the musical square. Maybe Frau Wagner can tell me more. Ah, oh, hello, Miss Walker.
that. Stop it. ride, but I am glad to see you, Kate Walker. Oscar, oh, I've missed you so much. I say, this display of emotion is most unreasonable, Kate Walker. I do hope you don't plan such profusion every time I change bodies. It's just that I've been worrying about you. Where were you, Oscar? Well, the mechanical instinct of my host took me for a ride, all across town. It took me the whole night to tame it, and that's when I bumped into those little rascals. <laughs> yeah, lucky I was in the area, huh? Quite. So, Kate Walker, what has happened since we parted at the Balaton River? Maybe we should just sit down for a second, Oscar. This, this might take a while. And that's when Demoiselle Lenny gave me the address of the Music Academy in this neighborhood. I see, Kate Walker. Any other thoughts, Oscar? Well, I guess I could ask you where we are heading. But truth be told, it doesn't really matter. I will follow you wherever you lead. And for as long as you require my services, Kate Walker. That's what an automaton does. Thank you, Oscar. Oh dear, I hope you're not going to become physical, are you? No, I was just going to give you a pat on the back. I would rather you refrain from having such thoughts. I am not a dog, you know. Whatever next. Anyway, we'd better get going, Oscar. And you'd better keep out of sight. <sighs> oh dear, I don't suppose I have any choice. Everything all right, Kate Walker? I'm so glad he's back. Is it really necessary for me to be shut up in here, Kate Walker? Sorry, Oscar, but I don't want to run the risk of losing you again. Guten Tag! What now? If you're from the council, you can come back when I'm not so busy. Oh, sorry, you startled me. <sighs> so, now what do you want, council minion? 
I'm not from the council. I'm, I'm just a visitor here. I came because I was hoping to look at the file of a student from the 1930s. Oh. I'm... I'm sorry. I, uh... It's just that I haven't time for digging up old files from 70 years ago. I have way too much to do here, you understand. I can tell you're a little overwhelmed. Where's the rest of the staff? Or, or maybe a student could show me. You are standing in front of the Rector, and the only employee of this academy. My name is Maximilian Mahler, and it falls upon me to manage everything on the premises. The maintenance, the archiving, and the lot before we close next month. So, if you don't mind. I'm very sorry to hear that the Academy is closing, and I can see you're extremely busy, but I've come such a long way to see it. I'd be so grateful if you could locate it. It's really important to me. And so is this place important to me, too. And I would love to hear the mechanical orchestra Play one last time before the Academy closes. But, alas, I can't, can I? Uh, unless, uh... Unless what? Well, um, you know. Okay, so you're suggesting that you'll only get me the file if I get that mechanical orchestra going? Is that it? Well, Herr Mahler, that's called blackmail. No, young lady. We call that, you scratch my back and I'll scratch yours. Otherwise, we all might as well live on islands, don't you think? Okay, I'll give it a try. Believe it or not, I have seen mechanisms like the one on the square before. Well, in that case, I promise to give you the file in return for your services. <laughs> Thanks. But I must warn you that the square has undergone some transformations over the years, and some parts of the mechanism may be difficult to get to. Don't worry, I'll make myself thin and slide between the cracks. You'll find some of them scattered around the square, and some of the others you'll find in the clock tower. Now, if you'll excuse me for a second, what are you... Now, uh, what is the name of that student you're interested in? Rose. Dana Rose. And what were the years she attended our illustrious academy? In the 30s. 1937, to be precise. Oh. And here it is. And here you will find the annual inspection reports of the mechanisms by Frau Beckman. Frau Beckman? She was the rectoress of the academy during the years you spoke of. These are from 1937. <laughs> you see, I have a marvelous memory regarding archives. <laughs> this is why I have chosen Frau Beckman's. Because there's something in here regarding that Edna Droz you spoke of. Dana. Dana Rose. Uh, quite. You will also find some sheet music with annotations. This is the Hymn of Bargain, which you must play on the piano on the square in order to activate the Orchestra of Automations. Once you have fixed the mechanisms, of course. All right then, here you go. What are you waiting for? Someone's added annotations. This sheet music corresponds to the piano part for the hymn of Wagen. Hmm. I wonder what it's supposed to represent. The report that the Rectoress of the Academy filled in with the help of Dana back in the 30s. According to the present Rector, I should find all the information I need to repair the mechanisms on the square.
Music Academy Inspection Report, October 12, 1937. Today, I was due to inspect the musical mechanisms that enable students to give a public display of their talent and enable us to showcase the quality of our teaching to the people of our beautiful town. Like every year, I needed a volunteer from our students to help me during the inspection. And this year's choice was obvious. I'm fine, really. Well, you're looking off color, darling, and on edge. No, it's just that... It's just that I haven't heard from Leon since he left with the Origin Expedition from Kantar. And also, I... Well, we've got company. You'll tell me later, Dana, darling. Meantime, be good and stay safe. You too, Yunta. Is everything all right? You look under the weather. We don't want one of our best and brightest to fall ill now, do we? I... I'm just a little worried, that's all. About my... About a friend who has left on a long voyage. And who was that lady? Um, just a friend. I met this summer. You do keep some surprising company, Fraulein Rose. Anyway, I have something for you that will take your mind off things. Oh? Would it interest you to see the mechanisms that enabled you to perform so brilliantly here last spring? That would be wonderful. Good. Come and join me at the kiosk when you have a moment. But don't be too long, though. Incredible. Isn't it just? You see these flags? Each mechanism housing for each musical automaton on the square is represented by one of these flags. Fascinating. Today is the day they are being serviced. Each mechanism has been inspected by an academy maintenance man. In theory, they're all functional. But if you like, you can go and see these maintenance men on my behalf and fetch back their respective reports. You would be doing me a big favor, as I have to inspect the piano in the kiosk. And also, it will give you a chance to take a peek at each of the automaton mechanisms. Thank you. I'd be delighted. Now, take this. You'll need it to open the maintenance room that leads to the most impressive mechanism of all, that of the clock tower. Thank you, Frau Beckmann. Do you have any questions before you go? When the mechanical orchestra played along with me last spring, it was incredible. But how does it manage to play at the same tempo as the piano? It was almost like in a dream. Oh, it wasn't dream work, Fraulein, but clockwork. The piano is connected to the mechanism that you are going to inspect and the hymn of Wagen played on the keys. That's what sets the rhythm and the intensity of the performance. And that's what triggers everything else. I'll go and see the maintenance team. Good. Thank you, Fraulein.
According to Frau Beckmann, it opens the maintenance room just next to the clock tower. Is there anything else you need, Fräulein? I'll go and see the maintenance team. Good. Thank you, Fräulein. Part of the mechanism was damaged, but I changed it. You can tell Frau Beckmann everything's in order now. This looks... complex. Looks like the Rector was right, Oscar. I should be able to find the mechanisms he wants me to repair by following the circuit Dana described in the report. They would still need to be accessible to us today, Kate Walker. Glad to see you haven't lost any of your legendary optimism, my dear Oscar. Because of that van, I can't get to the mechanism. I'll have to find a way to move it. I need to find the owner. Wagner Balfirma Dietrich, Guten Tag. Hello, excuse me, but your your van's parked on the square and it's it's blocking the way. Would you mind moving it? Oh, sorry about that. I'm with a client nearby. I'll move it right away. Thank you.
Looks locked. I can't go in. This looks... complex. I was lucky there was only one part needed changing in this mechanism. Hey, careful what you're doing here, right? Don't go and injure yourself or damage any of the material. Everything's fine upstairs. No need to return. I would love to be able to climb to the top of the clock tower. They say the mechanism is incredible. I just come down from the tower. You can tell Frau Beckman everything's in order up there. The mechanism's in perfect condition. I shouldn't touch it. Go on. Have a butcher's at the mechanism if you want. If only it could be as quick every year. What is this? What is this? wrong.
to be on the right track to successfully completing the service the Rector asked of you. Thanks, Oscar. But I still have to find the other mechanisms. Looks locked. I can't go in. wrong. Something's wrong.
see what's next. Looks locked. I can't go in. Wow. I would hate to be the one who must tune this. This looks... complex. I was lucky there was only one part needed changing in this mechanism. Seems perfectly functional. According to the report, we can access the clock tower mechanism through this building, in what today must be the back room. The, the elevator Dana saw during her inspection must be right here, behind the door. I need to find a way to reach it. should be able to get through it, if I can reach it. Now I just have to find the elevator to the clock tower. It might have been easier to ask for a clock to let you in, don't you think? According to the report, the elevator should be behind there. Let's hope it hasn't been walled up since. There. Okay, just need to clear the passageway.
I'm sure there's more for me to do here. I should open those large doors. I should be able to unlock the doors with that mechanism. Still magnificent, in spite of their age. I wonder how long it's been since they were activated. I don't think they mentioned this code in the report. Given the condition of that door, it should give way if I force it a bit. Impossible, Kate Walker. Such an act is illegal. Let's just hope that no police come by here. Hmm. Something's wrong.
The connection between this mechanism and the other ones on the square seems to be operational. Must have got it wrong. It won't work. No, I don't think so. Right. Okay. I think this is the last one. That's right, Kate Walker. You have to go back and activate the piano. All the mechanisms on the square are working. I just need to deal with the piano now. It looks like this wheel is designed to activate the piano's engine thanks to the dynamo effect, Kate Walker. Then I guess I'm gonna have to put my thinking cap on again. Better try something else. Kate Walker, are you intentionally trying to damage me? Okay, the sheet music is in place. Okay, the sheet music is in place. I can't play. The engine is off. 